Guten Tag. This is a Parker pen. Uh, and it's nice, isn't it? But it doesn't look like much. I'm going to tell you about it, show you it, and explain to you why it is a little bit special. Now, I'll just start right at the beginning, all the way back. I use one of these all the time. A classic Bic four-colour pen. And it's super useful. Uh, I'm, a, I'm an English teacher uh, by day, and uh, I correct stuff. I write stuff, I cross stuff out, and I've got, I've got all the four colours there, super useful, really easy to use, it's great. However, uh, you'll probably know by now if you're a regular uh, viewer, I like my stuff, my gadgets, my knives, my watches and so on, and this is a little on the basic side. So I thought, does this exist in a nicer format? And the answer is yes. It does, or it used to anyway. Now this is a vintage Parker pen and it's four colours. So it does the same thing as my plastic Bic, but in a much more attractive form. We've got lovely brushed stainless steel. There we've got gold arrow clip and it's just really attractive. And it, the balance is fantastic. It's beautiful to use. It's really, really good. How does it work? I don't really know, but <laughs> it's got the four colors. So there's the red, okay? So what you do is you twist the this end to have the color that you want there. And then you push, click, click down, just like a normal clicky pen. And can you see the red? I've got red ink. So let's, let's write red, ink fantastic now i want to change color so i'm going to unclick it turn it slightly round and then i've got the green up here press that there now i've got green ink green ink now i've finished with my green there's the green so i press the green down turn it to black now i've got black Now, black ink, oh, no space for some reason. Uh, <laughs> uh, now, we've finished with the black, so let's, what, what have we not done? We've not done blue, so where's blue? There's, there's blue. So, you have to line it up to where you want. There it is, blue, blue. So, we've got blue ink, space, yes. Sorry, I've gone a bit mental. Uh, so there you go, four colours in one normal looking pen, as opposed to the Bic, which is definitely chunkier. Uh, the form factor is significantly less appealing. So this Parker is, is, is a corker because it's, it looks like a normal pen, but it's got the four colours. Really, really good. How does it do that? Well, uh, let's just unscrew it. There's the four refills. So these are uh, Lamy M21. Oh, I should have said right at the beginning, and I kind of hinted at it by, by greeting you in German. Um, this is made in Germany. So hang on, Parker. Let's focus and get, get this so you can see. So it says Parker, made in Germany. Little logo there. The, uh, the arrow clip there. I don't think it's actually gold. No, it won't be actually gold. It's a gold colour. Um, what does it say on the end there? What does it say on the end there? C E M. Don't know what that means. If you know what that means, comment below. That would be cool to know. Uh, sorry about the focus coming in and out there. It's a really, really handsome thing. Now, I will be. Fully honest, I love it. It's fantastic. It's vintage, so they're not readily available. They take a little bit of searching to find. I got this. Where did I got get this from? A local um, sale site on on the internet. Um, they are available on eBay. They're not cheap, but they are really good. Now, 
slight quirk. So if I want to use the black, okay, I have to twist the top to get to black and then I push down and I've got green. So sometimes you're not quite sure where you started. So getting the right colour first time is not easy. There we go. So I, I, I had green. I needed to have turned it further to get to black. That's a little bit hidden. Oh, I've done it again. There we go. So that's black, isn't it? Yeah. So sometimes a little bit hit and miss finding the colour. And once you've got it, you've loosened the top. So uh, to write with it, kind of tighten it back up. Now it's all fine. It's absolutely fine. And I'm still in black. That's absolutely cool. But if I were to have left it uh, in the selection mode, if you want, uh, it's a bit loose and rattly. And you're not far off un unscrewing the whole thing. Um, that, that's it uh, selected, by the way. Uh, so that's just a little quirk that the selection process is nowhere near as simple as this. Uh, however, I, I, I'm perfectly happy to put up with that to get this beautiful form factor. Uh, the refills are no, nothing massively unusual. What is that? M a Lamy M21. I mean, I just got these off eBay, and they just they just can you see here? They just pu pull in and push push it push in. So pull out and push in easy. Not much to it. Uh, and that is that. That's everything you need to know about the Parker Four Color Pen that I love, and that I highly recommend. It's lush, really, really good. Love it. What I, I think what I like the most about it is that um, it, it doesn't look like much, but it's got hidden powers. Uh, and I've always been that way about gadgets. I like stuff that doesn't look like it can do much, but it can do stuff sort of that's a bit secret. So this just looks like a normal pen, but it's got full colours. It's a bit James Bondy. I mean, I'm not going to blow up Blofeld's volcano with this, but I could write about it in four different colours if someone else blew it up. So that's really cool. OK, well, there you go, folks. Thanks very much for watching my f <laughs> my odd little review of my uh, unusual little retro Parker pen. I hope you've enjoyed it. Click like if you did. Comment below if you know anything about this. I don't know much about Parker pens, and, and this one I don't know a huge amount. It's difficult to find information about uh, stuff like this uh, I just know that it's great um, have a look around my channel I do EDC uh, reviews and knife and watch reviews mainly so have a look there might be stuff there that, you, that uh, takes your fancy and subscribe a subscription would be really appreciated thanks very much for watching I'll see you soon